What's up, Deep Plushies 101 Workshop? It's your host, Matt, here. And uh, in today's video, I'm going to be um, telling you guys something that I'm actually thrilled about. My friend just ordered me Death Destroyer from Godzilla, which I'm super thrilled about. So um, about uh, about that is I'm getting some play tonight. I'm thinking about making Godzilla little mini chibi Godzilla figures out of them. So hopefully I can, and hopefully we'll see how they turn out, which I'm hoping they turn out beautifully. Um, uh, what else, what else, what else? Um, yes, Destroyer is the evil entity that killed Godzilla in the original one. He, uh, Godzilla was a fight in, in fire mode, and Destroyer kind of destroyed him, which was sad as hex. Oh my god, it was so sad. But you know what? I'm going to make a story. Rodan versus Destroyer. Let's see how that goes. You know who'd win. It'd be Destroyer, but still, it'd be a good story to write, so why not? Why not write any stories that I can imagine myself with, you know? Um, it's either going to be that, that I'm going to build the Chibis with, or it's going to be it's going to be the Club Penguins again. So I love making these, but the only thing is they, they are fragile. They break real easily sometimes, if you're not careful. Like, mine is... Mine broke right here. If you can see that little little uh, part right there, it broke off. And then, like I said, I, I made a beach ball for them. I made a puffle, a pink puffle, and a yellow puffle by the name of Sunny. And I keep them in a tin can, which is a gingerbread house, which is pretty unique. It's pretty cool. But, um... But I will do an unboxing of Destroyer when I get them Sunday, I believe is the date that I'll be getting them, which is a soon date expected, which is the date expected of him, Sunday. So I will be unboxing him then. Um, not sure about, uh, I know Sonny's got me a package, Sonny's got me a package, which I'm very grateful for. I can't open that up till the 16th, and that has to be opened up on a Zoom call. But when I, when I open it and stuff, I will I will unbox it on video. So don't worry about that. I already got that under control. Um, what else? What else? Something I bought at the thrift store a while back that I do want to show you guys was a big cradle. The huge cradle for my plushies and stuff, which is pretty cool and pretty unique. Pretty awesome. I, I'm sorry I keep saying unique, you guys. And yeah, watch out. Okay. This thing right here is huge. It's humongous. Um, um, again, it's got flowers on the edge of it. It's beautiful. I, I uh, took it because I could, I could use it. Get out of there. Get out of there, Loki. Get out of there. I could use it for my my stuff that I'm using it for. I could use it for anything, really, for my... Get out of there. Get out of there. Sorry, you guys. I could use it for my cabbage trash doll. I could use it for anything I really, truly imagine to use it for. So I'm thinking about using it as for my cabbage trash doll. Because I do have a pillow for them. So I'll be right back, you guys. Stay right there for me. Um, I'll that pillow for him. Could be in here. Yeah, they're here. And then, yeah. Ow! Frick. Sorry, guys. So, this is what it looks like. As he's laying in it, this is what it looks like with him laying in it. He lays perfectly and peacefully, which I love about cabbage trash dolls. They, lay, they, they smile either way. You can rock it, and it rocks back and forth, make him go to sleep and stuff like that. So it's pretty cool. It's pretty it's pretty awesome. Um, another thing I have that I forgot to show you guys is the Hogwarts train. I have this, the Hogwarts Build-A-Bear train that my brother got me. Brother Chris got me and he bought for me, which I was so happy and thrilled about it. You guys, you always know, don't even know because I've been wanting this for a while now and I finally got it. And yeah, he got me this for my birthday a while back, which I was, I was happy about. But yeah, but 
But that just goes to show it that people people are so nice, people are so kind. You know, people are people do a lot for people, and it's it's amazing in this world. So never give up, guys. Never give up hope. Never lose the love and of uh, self of everything because you never know what you what what you got going on in life and everything. So I am gonna let you guys go here. Um, if you guys like, uh, please like and subscribe for more. And actually, in, in all honesty, I might, I might do something different. I might make McGill out of clay and uh, and um, and uh, floppy. So we'll we'll see we'll see we'll see what I, I think of after I get done with building McGill out of clay because I might I might just do that and have fun with it. I don't know yet. I had I have a lot of thinking to do. So all right, you guys. Peace. Love you guys. Peace.